Hi guys, before we get into today's video, I am, this is kind of like future Amberina talking to you. I just wanted to start this video off with something which is time sensitive, so that's why I'm kind of coming at you uh, a few days ahead of time if that makes sense. But basically, I'm starting my next round of the Glow Up Challenge on Monday the 22nd. So if you wanted to join us in this round, then please do click the link that I'm going to put in the description box below because there is still time for you to join if you see this video on Thursday, Friday, Saturday or Sunday. Please do get in touch if you want to find out more information. We had such incredible results with the first 10 women that got involved and took on the challenge. Uh, one of them lost a stone, another one lost eight kilos. I know I'm talking kilos and stones and mixing it all up, but that's how they did it. Everything was personalized. Their whole programs were personalized to them as much as possible so that they could achieve the results that they wanted to. And all 10 of them have been so impressed. And so I'm just so happy to have made them so happy and help them reach their goals or get closer to reaching their goals. So if you wanted to also do that too, then don't hesitate, just get in touch. Ha! Huh. And with that said, let's get into this week's vlog. Good morning, everyone. It is Saturday and it is two days after I put up my last video and I'm so glad that you guys were so pleased to see me back on YouTube because it's been so long and obviously I was nervous that <laughs> um, I yeah you kind of feel about whether I'm relevant anymore and I kind of got to the stage where I thought I don't care if I'm relevant anymore I'm going to do it anyway I kind of like looking back at my own oh lost the light the sun has gone in hold on sorry about that the sun is playing silly buggers oh there it goes again uh, playing with silly buggers uh, behind the clouds and stuff. It's one of those days. It's blustery and it's windy outside, but there are blue skies, which is gorgeous, and some beautiful white clouds. I don't mind clouds as long as they're white and that they don't cover the whole sky. But you didn't come here for a weather report. So yeah, I was just saying, I'm really glad that I put up that video. It was, if you missed it, it was a bit of a life update and why I haven't been on YouTube for two months, basically. Um, and I guess it actually comes back to what I just said about feeling relevant. I just felt like I had nothing worth putting up while I was in quarantine, uh, while we were all in lockdown, I should say. And um, yeah, because I was just at home and I thought, how interesting can that be for you guys? And also, like I also said, I thought it mattered that, you know, my roots weren't done, that I, uh, my skin was really reacting badly to the effects of being in lockdown. I, I suppose the stress, the anxiety was just coming up through my skin and stuff like that. So, um, but yeah, I'm just glad that I, I just kind of did it, put it out there. If you can hear noise in the background, it's because on the dining table, both the cats are playing with all sorts of little things and... I haven't got the heart to move them. They're having such a good time. Oh my goodness, sorry. That is the sun. Um, but yeah, so we, I think I mentioned in my last video that like, it just seems to be that everything wants to break down right now. So in the last video, I was telling you about some water damage that we had, my freezer broke, I got a flat tire. My car was just sitting on the driveway, I got a flat tire. So that has all been, you know, we're working on all of that. But since I made that last video, now the dishwasher had to, um, decided to pack up like the connection on the wall so we had to get an electrician in to sort that out yesterday. Our hoovers, both our Dyson hoovers have broken or just not working. Does anyone else have that problem? Like We've replaced our Dysons so many times and now we're just fed up. We are not replacing the Dysons with more Dysons because they just seem to have this kind of, um, they're light. They seem to have this built-in uh, shelf life and they just don't pick up any anything off the carpets anymore and obviously you know I've got these two cats so they're long-haired cats so we have ordered a Henry. No we haven't, we've ordered a Harry. We used to have a Henry years ago. I think I even had a Henrietta. You know the um, the hoovers that you, you see being used in office blocks and stuff and they're used there for a reason because they are so... Uh, robust. Sorry, I should just say also, this is none of this is obviously sponsored or the companies don't know I'm talking about them, neither Dyson nor Henry, Henrietta. I'm just talking about it from what's going on in our house. So the carpets look horrendous because 
we've just not been able to hoover effectively recently. I know this is really dull, but this is what's going on in my life. So we are waiting for our Harry, no, our Harry to arrive tomorrow. And I'm just going to be hoovering all day tomorrow. I actually can't wait. I love, I think I find hoovering really therapeutic anyway. I just le love seeing that transformation. So um, I actually bought some shaken vac. What a throwback. Anyone remember that? <laughs> managed to get hold of and shaken back so tomorrow as soon as the harry arrives i'm going to be hoovering the house like crazy and revealing our beautiful off-white carpets that have just been kind of looking a bit lackluster because obviously as the cats molt and the, and the hair builds up and stuff invisible to the naked eye but it makes a difference to the carpet so i can't wait for that um and this week i have been launching my second intake to the glow up method which I talked about in the last video so if you did not see the last video you definitely need to catch up because I really update you there why I haven't been on YouTube for two months and also what I've been creating and I'm very very excited with it and very proud of it so oh gosh the light sorry yeah I seem to be talking at 19 to the dozen I don't know what that's about could be the fact that I've had two coffees and I've had lunch so I've had like a mega energy rush but today I'm not going to do any work whatsoever, nothing to do with work. My husband is on a mission to get me to relax because I've been so wound up all week with all of this. So I'm not going to do any work at all. I'm going to take it easy. I'm finding it really hard because my mind is racing 19 to the dozen with all the things that I want to do or need to do or trying to figure out what I need to do. Um, but I'm trying not to do any of it at all. So I've been keeping myself occupied this morning with making TikTok videos. <laughs> completely fabulous use of time not but that's what I've been doing this morning um, I am itching my fingers are itching to get on with doing more work on glow up method program but he as I said is on a mission to make sure that we just relax today I think we're going to go and socially distance visit my mother-in-law today as well because um, we can and yeah the today is going to be very very chilled and my plan was to go and sit outside in the garden but I'm looking right now and the sun as you can tell is just going in and out and it's very blustery so it may actually not be as oh and we've lost the light yeah it may not be as uh, as enjoyable as I was thinking it might be so yeah anyway I think I'm going to go play with my cats now and I will catch up with you later. One of the comments, by the way, that I got uh, in my DMs about the most recent video that went up on Thursday was that it you felt that it's... What, what did she say? It was like you, uh, you felt that you were just sitting down and having a chat with me, a latter, over a cup of tea. And I'm glad that that's the case. I was a bit worried when I put it up and I thought, oh, I'm just basically talking to camera for the whole video. A bit like a talking head. But you seem to like that, so that's good. I'm glad for that. Um, thank you for all the lovely comments and uh, messages and stuff that you've been sending me since I put that video up on Thursday. Okay, I'm going to get emotional, so um, I'll see you in a little bit. Here are the boys, as I was saying. They have moved off the dining table and they're just sitting on the chairs. But actually, you can also probably see the carpet. Look, it's just... There's just little bits of cat hair everywhere. Hi, Hux. You want to be in there? Um, so I can't wait. There's Hermes as well. I can't wait to get our Hoover tomorrow. I literally cannot wait. Good morning, everyone. I'm afraid I did not film anything more yesterday. It turned out to be a bit of a washout day. Um, I think I had a bit of a what my husband thinks is a cathartic release because um, I'd just come to the end of six weeks with my glow up girls and just recruiting some new people and it's all been really really manic all week so um i think i said yesterday he just said to me take it easy take it chill don't want you to do anything and i uh ended up taking an afternoon nap which i never ever do i never do so i had an afternoon nap i did not make it to my mother-in-law's i just i was at home and took it really really chilled um and now it's sunday and it's beautifully sunny and i'm feeling super super positive again um did not feel that way yesterday but today yeah back on track back to the normal amberina back to normal me so i'm really kind of yeah full of zing and zest and super excited because we've just had a delivery like the 
the things that get me excited now are so different from the things that were getting me excited three months ago. Um, like when I managed to get myself a Tesco shop, oh my goodness, when I get a booking, that is the most excitement in the house. Everyone is running around the house with excitement. But right now, we have just had a delivery. And my battery is flashing, so I'm probably gonna have to go and change my battery any second now, but just look who's arrived. This is Harry. We finally have a new Hoover, and we have said goodbye to both our Dysons. We have a handheld one, and like a cordless one, and the big one, both of them. Thank goodbye, you. and hello, Harry. Good morning, everyone. It is um, Tuesday, I think. Yes, it is Tuesday. Just checking on my watch. The days are really just like, melding into one. Oh, there's someone at the door. Hold on. Sorry about that. Always, whenever I start to film, that's when there's someone at the door. And actually, it is this massive, well, not massive, but it is a box. And I've stopped ordering stuff. I've stopped buying stuff. I've tried to anyway. I've got, well, that's not true. I have got a couple of things to show you, which I did promise. So I'm going to show you those. Um, but other than that, I don't know what this is, so I might even open this up with you. It's probably something really, really boring that my husband has ordered, um, but I can't really tell what it is. Anyway, yeah, it's been a few days since I vlogged and um, it's been busy. It has been busy, so I just wanted to catch up with you. I am going to open up those boxes today with you. My hair's looking a bit big today. I used a different shampoo a different conditioner but i also used and i think that's why my hair is looking kind of quite big i washed it yesterday i used the nanogen root spray root volume root boost spray but it is really good last week i used the same spray but i made the mistake of using it on my roots and all the way to the bottom and it made my hair a little bit uh crunchy and and not how I like it. I like my hair to just be with nothing in it at the mid lengths and ends. So yeah, I'm really impressed with this Nanogen Root Spray, by the way. If you wanted it, I'm gonna try and link it down below. I'm not sure where it's available online, but if I can find it, I will link it for you. Um, I'm still grappling with sleep, by the way, guys. Really, really grappling with sleep. Last night, I didn't really sleep at all, at all. I was reading till two, which probably doesn't help. Oh, started the best new book, started the best new book. It's called The Professor and the Housekeeper. Again, I'll link it below if I can. It's so good. I have it on Kindle, so I can't actually show you a picture of the cover, but it is so, so good. I'm loving it. Um, yeah, so I stayed up till two o'clock reading the first two chapters of that. That's probably not a good idea. I think it is time to start on my morning coffee. And uh, then I will open up the packages with you. I'm kind of liking this uh, no makeup today. I wore a full face of makeup yesterday because I had to film some stories. So I think I'm actually just going to stay off the makeup today. Um, but let's, oh, and let's hold the camera still first of all. But let's open up a couple of boxes. One of them is going to be a bit like a deja vu. If you watched last week's vlog, Literally, it will feel like a deja vu, but I'm going to open that particular item up right now And then I'm also going to open up the box that just arrived when I started talking to you just now So let's get into this. I also have a box that looks like it's full of sweets It's not but we'll open that one too. So first up is the one that I'm going to call a deja vu um, I have to say guys I kind of took a week off exercising last week. I don't know why. I think it was the weather, I was feeling down, it was the time of the month, all of that kind of thing. And I just, the more I didn't exercise, the more I felt down. And this week, I think it helps that the sun is out every day. Uh, I don't even care if it's cold, I, as long as it's bright. That's fine with me. Um, and because of that, I just feel more positive and I've been getting up and doing things. My to-do list is, is, a, is, a, is a positive challenge rather than something that I feel I've got to get through in the day. So yeah, I don't know about you guys. I know I have up days and down days in terms of motivation and feeling positive and energized. And it's really, really hard to stay on track all the time like lockdown is really i think taken its toll but i do think that getting outside 
and doing some exercise or if you can't get outside just even at home just doing some exercise can really really help your endorphins and then your serotonin levels I cannot recommend it enough so there's loads of videos that you can just follow on YouTube um, I've put up some videos as well if you wanted to follow those okay I'm into the box really not a surprise it's another little package from the outnet so last week i showed you the most beautiful silk slip dress with lace inserts all the way through it that i bought from the outnet and i asked you guys should i get the cream one and i don't think i even waited if i'm really honest i don't even wait to see what you guys said should i get it should i not i just got it because it was the last one in my size so I picked up the cream colored one as well cream is never going to show up as well on camera I'll put it on like I did with the pink one and show it to you but it's basically a full-length maxi dress silk and lace inserts and it's just so pretty it's like a, a really beautiful dreamy slip dress does come obviously with a little slip underneath it but I'll put it on and show it to you so this is the cream version of the dress I would have to wear this with high heel wedges which I'm very happy to do this actually seems like it's better length for me although it's exactly the same size dress and yeah I love it let me know what you think I know some of you are going to say it looks like a nighty. I don't care I absolutely love it that is the dress I thought I would just show it to you really quickly in its full entirety sweeties anyone no not really I don't know why it came in the sweetie box but I do need to open this so let's get into this right now I bet you couldn't have guessed that this is what it was we've had such glorious weather in lockdown but to the point where my lawn is now like a mix of straw and grass so I thought I'd buy one of these sprinkler things to go on the garden hose and of course when I bought it first of all so this is like a really the most boring story but I bought one waited for it to come and then like five days later they sent me an email say it's sold out so I don't know why they took my order anyway I went online again and I bought another one it's a different one but at least it's arrived but by the time it arrived we've had rain for three days non-stop so I haven't even taken it out of the box I think I will use it today though because we had no rain yesterday and I don't think there's going to be any rain today but I love this it's one of these ones that goes round and round I was trying to get the one that oscillates from side to side but I think that this will work just as well I don't know if you guys know anything about garden sprinklers please let me know if this is a good one to get it's a bit late now because I bought it and it's really hard to get anything at the moment everything in terms of the garden is just sold out it's incredible that the, the nation has gone garden crazy and I don't blame them I've gone garden crazy too right Last up, let's open up this box that just arrived when I was talking to you this morning. I do know who it's from now, which is great. And I promise you, I didn't order anything. This is a PR unboxing. And I didn't know it was coming, which makes it even more exciting. From my faves my babes at by terry look at i love their packaging first of all you know i love the color purple i use purple in all my instagram stories for all my captions theirs is a really beautiful regal deep purple but let's take a little look inside oh cute we have a beautiful little by terry cosmetic pouch i don't think i have any by them at all Oh, and there's a couple of things in here too. Well, I mean, I'm sounding surprised, but I would, ex you know, you would expect a little something inside, wouldn't you? So we have, oh, I love them. I love them so much. This is the Hyaluronic Pressed Hydra Powder. So, you know, I set, I'm not wearing makeup now, but when I do wear concealer, um, I do use the Hyaluronic Powder. It's a loose powder to set everything. And I love the fact that it's Hyaluronic. I use it under my eyes because it doesn't dry out my eyes, but it's not something that you can, that I would take out and about with me because I just, the idea of taking a loose powder out with me is just not what I want to be doing. So there is a pressed one. The packaging with By Terry is always so beautiful. 
This is in their classic purple packaging with the silver. There it is. That is the pressed hyaluronic powder with a little powder puff. Just to be able to touch up on the go and there's a nice full size mirror in that as well. So that is a lovely little addition to my collection and we have a top up of my hyaluronic hydro powder. So this is the one that I use when I'm setting my makeup at home and I use a loose powder for that because I find that it gives the best results. So that is a colourless, literally colourless translucent powder. It looks white but it's completely colourless and I use that specifically under my eyes and it's quite nice to use just all over the face really because it is colourless and so lightweight and it's hydrating as well because it's got hyaluronic acid in it. Anyway, thank you very much by Terry for that. Um, I love this. Um, I think that it is time to end the vlog here. So thank you so much for watching. And as I said last time, I kind of feel like I don't have anything really exciting to tell you in my vlogs. But on the other hand, I've been loving getting the messages saying, why aren't you vlogging again? And, you know, nice to see you back on YouTube. So I will continue to do my little vlogs. I am going to do a couple of sit down videos as well. But um, I will just say, if you're not following me on Instagram, then please do, because I'm on there all the time, every day. And I've recently started getting into TikTok for my sins. Um, I'm not that regular on TikTok, but I am having a lot of fun over there. It allows you to show a different side of your personality that I think we just don't show on Instagram and YouTube. So I would love it if you would go follow me on TikTok. I will put all the links to everything in the description box below and links to anything that I've mentioned as well, if it can be linked, like the Buy Terry products, um, maybe the dress. I think that it's sold out. There might be one left in one size. I'll find out. Anyway, thanks so much for watching. Thank you for still being here with me on YouTube with the vlogs and stay tuned for some sit down videos as well, some skincare stuff coming up soon. I'll see you next week. Bye.